Hey, what's going on, everybody? It's your boy, Mr. Boost, here to show you how to set up the Spotify slash pretzel alert widget for your OBS and slobs. Let's hop right into it. So the first thing you're going to find in the Discord is going to be the snip download, uh, the pretzel link for their download, and then the files that you're going to need for the alert widget itself. Uh, so first things first, let's go ahead and start out with the snip. Uh, once you click the snip link, it's going to take you right to their GitHub page where you're going to download the snip file, which is just going to be this guy right here. Um, I've went ahead and already downloaded it. So we're just going to go ahead and open the folder up and inside of it, you're going to have a snip folder. Uh, what you can do is just drag and drop the snip folder into your desktop or wherever you would like. Uh, and then we're going to go ahead and open it up. Inside it's going to be some files, including the snip program itself. Uh, we're going to go ahead and open it up and it'll launch uh, a web page and if you get this you're good to go if not it'll be a login page which you'll just log into your spotify and then you're off to the races so we'll go ahead and close that guy down now that we've got snip taken care of the next thing you, that you're going to need to download is going to be the widget itself so we'll go ahead and open that up inside of it is going to be two files you're going to have your vibrance pretzel and your vibrance spotify what you can do is just copy both or if you don't need one or the other, you can just move the one. And we're going to drag this right into the SNP folder itself. So now we've got the SNP folder, the SNP application, and then the widget files inside of that. So we can go ahead and close it. Uh, the next step is to make sure that we have the correct settings for SNP. Uh, because if the settings are not set up correctly, it will not display uh, inside of OBS. So once you have opened it, it'll drop down in your taskbar. You just come down here and right click it. And we need to make sure that save information separately is checked. It's extremely important. If it is not checked, it will not work correctly. So we'll go ahead and check that now. We will then open up our OBS. Just kind of move these around here. Uh, being that we're going to be testing first with Spotify, we'll go ahead and take the Spotify HTML file, drag and drop it right into the OBS. We'll go ahead and open up our Spotify here. And then we will play a song. And then it should take off automatically just like that. Uh, it works like an alert from one of our packs. So on it, it's going to pop up, display the, the information, and then go away. So it's not going to clutter your screen. It's just going to pop up whenever a new song comes up. So every time, as you'll see, a new song fires, the alert plays, and then it's going to hide again. Super simple setup. Uh, very basic. So next, we will go and do the pretzel one. The pretzel one has a few more steps to it, but it's still very simple. The pretzel application I've already installed as well on here. So we'll just open this bad dude up, move our files around here. That way we can make some room. Uh, once you have the pretzel application open in the bottom left corner, you'll have uh, basically your Twitch name and then a little gear icon. You'll click the gear icon, which is going to open up your settings. You're then going to scroll down to file output. Uh, what we're going to do here is check the right track info to file. And then we're going to hit the plus symbol. That's going to open everything up. So that way we can uh, save the pretzel information output file uh, to a specific location. Uh, from the beginning step, whenever you originally created your own folder, like with this one, we use SNP. So we had the SNP folder. We're going to navigate back to that SNP folder. And then we are going to create a file just named pretzel. We'll go ahead and save that. Once that is finished, we can go back home. Bring our OBS back up. Take our Vibrance pretzel file we'll drag and drop it right in and then in our pretzel we can go ahead and play a song here and same as the spotify widget 
It's going to pop up, display the information, and then hide away. Uh, every time we play a new song, rinse and repeat. Uh, outside of that, that's pretty much all you got to do. It's very simple widget setup. Um, <clears throat> can be very confusing and intimidating at first, um, but it's very straightforward uh, on how to set everything up. If you have any kind of questions uh, in the Discord, you can put a ticket in. Uh, I can answer any kind of questions. Um, but outside of that, that's pretty much it. Y'all have a good day. I'm out. See ya.